Okay, now for question number four from the specimen paper, paper two of the uh, IGCSE 2020 syllabus. Here we have a um, question says chai that uh, chai says that eight centimeters squared is the same as 80 millimeters squared. Explain why chai is wrong. Well, the reason why chai is wrong is that these are squared units; they're not normal units. So we can say that one centimeters squared is the same as 10 squared millimeters squared. So that means one centimeter squared is the same as 100 millimeters squared. And because these are square units, these are units of area which are square units. Okay, now if you don't understand why this is the case, I'm gonna just explain it to you in this way. Just say this has the line, this line here, and let's say its length is one centimeter now in millimeters, what would that be? Well, one centimeter, as we know, is 10 millimeters. Okay, so one centimeter is equivalent to 10 millimeters. So this line is one centimeter long, which means it's 10 millimeters long. Now if I were to convert this line into like a box, a square, or just you know, add a few sides to it like this, this is now a square. Just say this is a square. It's not a very good square, but just imagine it's a square. Now, this length also is one centimeter, which is equivalent to 10 millimeters. Now, if I'm going to write down the area of this square in centimeter squared, and the area of this very same square in millimeters squared, and in centimeters squared, you multiply one by one, which gives you one. In millimeters squared, you multiply 10 by 10, which gives you 10 times 10, which is 10 squared, which gives you 100. So when you are Converting units of area, you have to square the normal conversion. So if one centimeter, um, you know, if, if one centimeter is equal to 10 millimeter, then one centimeter squared is equal to 10 squared millimeter squared. And one centimeter cubed would be 10 cubed millimeters cubed because if you were to make this into like a cuboid a cube actually okay where all the lengths were one centimeter okay then you'd see that the volume of this if that's one centimeter which is 10 millimeters you'll have one times one times one which is one centimeters cubed and 10 times 10 times 10 which is 10 cubed millimeters cubed so you cube the normal conversion Okay, so therefore one centimeter squared is equal to 100 millimeter, 100 millimeter squared. So therefore eight centimeters squared is not 80 millimeters squared. Okay, so something like that is fine as your explanation. So um, again, I'm going through some more detail than you might seem, you know, is necessary uh, for those of you who do understand. And the reason I'm going through this extra detail is for those people who maybe not understand the concept that well and to help them to get to understand it. Okay, so thank you for watching. As I said, all the other questions can be found in the playlist. The playlist is in the description, which is below the video, and uh, you can get a link to the playlist from there, and then you can go to whichever question you want from this particular paper. Thank you for watching.